Hey boys and girls, it's Mr. You, your friendly neighborhood science teacher. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to check into Infinite Campus so you can get credit for being on distance learning at school. You need to do this for every single period, whether you're in asynchronous or synchronous classrooms. So Monday through Friday, please do this process for each of your periods for all your subjects. So first, um, I have a shortcut for Infinite Campus, but if you want to go to Infinite Campus, you have to do this right here. Another way to go to your Infinite Campus is to go to PUHSD. Can you open up a new tab? Open up a new tab and go to the school district's website. Now click on class link. Class link. Yep, and then sign in with Google. Sign in with Google. If you don't have a shortcut, you can you guys you guys can just do this part, okay? And then and click on yep. Okay, now walk us through your process of logging in. Okay. So you click in a campus student. Right. So at the top where it says student name is where you put your student ID. This is the ID that's on your um, on your schedule, and then your password is the password that you use to log into your Chromebook. Okay, and then you press login. Okay. And then you see these check-ins. Check-ins right here. You, you just click this, and then you say, yes, I'm here. And that's how you take attendance. So uh, the really important thing with this um, login situation is you have to show up to the correct time uh, when you log in. So when Brianna goes to her second period, which is world history, she has to go to this web page at 9.05 and then she'll be able to check into that website as well. All right. Thank you so much.